Cause you're a superstar. I'm back. I'm Bazura. I'm an actress. <laughs> Sorry. I'm also a singer. Well, aspiring to be. And also a businesswoman. I'm a producer. Um, some show. Last year, you may have seen me on Facing Up To Me. Kami. <laughs> Why are you doing this right no, now? No matter what happens, it's okay. What if I don't get married ever? Welcome to my new house. Having a show about my life is really nerve-wracking for me. Hey, 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 hey. They don't know me. I can't believe I did that, but I did. I'm so glad and excited. Switch. Switch. We ride and we die together with our brokens. <laughs> Basra, you're fabulous. Thank you. <laughs> Making this show was one of the hardest decisions I've ever made in my life. Why I decided to do it in the end was because I think it's time for my fans to really get to know me for who I am, not by what was written about me or what was said about me. You guys know that the tweet thingy thingy that fans is doing. I want to get closer to my fans and hear what they think and what yes. they and they feel. See, that's the, the amazing thing about social media. I've like decided to tweet. About what? You know, how do you know if you found the one? Is it better to fix your past or face the future? Are there friendships worth fighting for? So now we're gonna hear the real stuff. Okay, sent. But actually, making this show, it's the greatest gift that I could give to my fans. Love you. Since you last saw me, I've been working hard. I completed a movie, been designing, I was in LA recently and had the opportunity to visit the E! News office. I met up with Kat, Juliana Rancic. What's the other guy's name? Who? Terence. Yes, I know his name. His name is Terence J. And just a couple months ago, I have been given the opportunity to host the Malaysian F1 party with George Katsiopoulos. You know, the cool guy from Fashion Police. Uh, I met up with Lorraine Shorts. Lorraine Shorts Diamonds. Lorraine Shorts Diamonds have been worn by Beyonce, Kim Kardashian, and Blake Lively. I met Michael Russo from Ruffin Russo, a famous designer who dressed Angelina Jolie, Michelle Obama, Gwyneth Paltrow. I've certainly had some great opportunities since last year. I've been mixing with a different crowd, but I'm still the same person. So last season, you saw me singing my first song, Sayangi Dirimu. I had the chance to personally cast real people to be featured in my music video. Amanda Amel Amri. Yes, I did it. And I hope that you get inspired by the song too. I co-directed the music video and I feel that one of the most important scenes was the ending scene where I had haters on one side, lovers on the other side. All I did was just like walking down the runway confidently and not caring about what people say, just being confident and loving myself. I think that was such a powerful scene and I think that's how each and every one of us should really walk on this world. Just appreciate your lovers and appreciate your haters because everyone's a blessing. And this year, I have a new song. It was written by my band. I have a band now. It's called The What Loose. I think at this present moment, I'm really happy. I'm super happy with my life. Everything is just great. In the last couple of months, I realized now that I have been making most decisions on my own for my career, for everything in my life. And I don't know why I still have a manager when he's not really managing me anymore. You okay? Right. okay. <laughs> Farid has been my friend for nine years and my manager, I think about two years. <laughs> Last year, Farid had been amazing. We have another interview on the 24th. Then December, we have... Wait, I don't get a rest? He's always been there with me. You I care, mean, but it's going to be very tight. I don't care. I don't have to sleep. I can sleep when I die. Wow. Lately, I've been having a hard time just finding my manager. Like, where are you? Yeah. He's been missing a lot <laughs> and it's really causing a lot of problems for me. At some particular moments, I feel like when I am forced to just do things on my own, I'm able to. So no matter what happens, if I you know, don't have anyone around me, I feel like I can do it on my own.
Today I'm meeting my producer at Red Film because I haven't been having a manager quite often lately. We're wearing blue shirts. Oh my god, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good boy band, isn't it? Or girl band? Blue shirt. Blue shirt. Blue shirt. Yeah. Yeah. How are you? This year, I'm very lucky to be nominated for Best Actress and Best Supporting Actress. Malaysian Film Festival is one of the most prestigious award shows in Malaysia. And this year, both categories I'm nominated in are films, both produced by Lina Tan. For more than 10 years now, we've been making so many movies together and TV series. Congrats, congrats. Both are your congrats. movies. So that's why I'm early today, because I want more jobs. Wonder la, yeah. early. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we haven't really confirmed anything very much yet, but just thought I wanted to run it by you first. It's a kind of drama, horror, it's set in a school. Oh, cute school boys. Oh my god, I'm 31. You Sorry. can still play college, okay? <laughs> can you play school girl? I can, right? Yeah. But if Madonna can wear like skimpy outfits, we can all be children again. I'm, I'm looking at assembling an actor that's not just from Malaysia. For Indonesia, you have someone in mind. Yeah. And then maybe who knows, we'll we can have. Because I, I don't want, I see this as a, an international Piolo? Piolo? Oh, Piolo Pasqual. Who is Piolo Pasqual? He's an actor from the Philippines. We presented an award together at a film festival and we've been friends since. He's not very good looking, you know. Really? I don't think he's very good looking. I'm kidding. Good he's, very good looking. Yeah. <laughs> he's very good looking. I mean, really. So. Okay. He's a good um, actor. Yeah. Very good actor. Yeah. My armpit's getting sweaty now, hang on. Yes, he's very good looking. It's really, it's getting really hot. Okay. <clears throat> I don't know what you guys saw in me. Yeah. I mean, until today, I, I still don't know. What is it that you guys saw in me? I don't me? know. So I was like, me? Let me tell you about me. Okay, my name is Fad. <laughs> and I was like talking yeah, yeah, all yeah, about yeah. me, 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 you, me, you me, me, me. You were the character. <laughs> you know, any time I get to work with her, it gets me really excited because that means I get to make more movies and more nominations. She gave me an audition for my third film, Gold and Ginchu. That, that character was written as a, someone who studied fashion. Yes, and I was studying fashion back then. So, yeah. yeah, and then now you have your own fashion thing. I know, right? I attracted that energy while I was playing Putri. It's funny how things have a way of falling into place. I am thankful for everything. Good Everyone's a blessing. Yeah. What haven't you done yet? I really miss going on set. I really miss... Yeah. All the sleepless nights and all that. We... So, so are we going back to Kapitol? Nah. Mana Cinta tu? Where shall we go? Next no, we should go somewhere else. I went everywhere else, but not Italy. If I win, we go Italy, okay? To Italy, okay? <laughs> to coffee, by the way, thank you. After my conversations with Lena, it got me thinking, after all the movies I've done with her, all the accomplishments and two nominations at FFM, have I made it? I mean, really. Okay, so, I'm gonna okay. make a move. All right, okay. thanks for coming in. Oh, yeah, thank yeah, you yeah. for thanks, giving thanks, me thanks, a job. Yeah, <laughs> yeah no, 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 Love no, you. No, no. Thank you. Thanks for coming. And who is better to us than you? Coming up. Right now, I've just been really nervous about the okay. Hollywood movie. Hey, it's okay. It was about a porn video of you. I mean, come on. Don't I have better things to do in life? Pelakon wanita terbaik FFM 27 dianugerahkan kepada... Morning. Hi, morning, Kapas. Hi, Hi, how are you? Hi. So excited. <laughs> Good. So... Okay, so what do you have here? This is what we discussed hari itu kan. Fami is my designer. I tell him what to do and he just designed them for me. I'm the queen bee, he's a worker bee. For my collection, it was a long process. I was involved in every step of the way and I was really obsessed with everything being perfect. Every detail of it was crucial to me. So you, you want to change or...? No, I think it's okay. It's been my dream to showcase my collection at the KL Fashion Week and finally it's happening for me. Okay, so the blazer, right? I think maybe black to maroon. Lah. Black to maroon, I think. Black to maroon is nice stuff. It's going to be on the runway, so it has to be perfect. Okay, got guys. Great! Ah! <laughs> Doll domination, here we go! <laughs> Wait, hang on, I need you to sketch this. And I heard that there was an Instagram post made by a certain someone to discourage me and other instant designers, that's what he called them, that has no fashion background showcasing their ugly designs at Fashion Week coming up. It was not a very nice comment, 
you know, if he believes something cannot be done, he should not interrupt people who are doing it. Yay! Job well done. Very nice. I need everything done. Let's contact all the tailors today. Tell them to make sure that everything should be ready. We have 32 designs. 32 is a lot. A lot. Yeah. <laughs> Should we have lobster as well? Should we have lobster? Oh, of course. I think yeah. we should have the lime pole lobster. Yeah. Um, yeah. Grilled. Grilled. <laughs> grilled. Sure. Thank, yeah. you. Thank you. I had a misunderstanding with V um, in the last season, um, but we're still very good friends. So we're actually much closer now. I've been busy with a lot of things. Right now, I've just been really nervous about the audition okay. for the Hollywood movie. Mm -hmm. but I've recently received an email of an offer to attend an audition for a Hollywood film called Pharmacide. The audition is getting closer. Ooh. I kind of need someone to like rehearse it with. I'll do it with you. Right? Yes. Okay, okay. I have it I have it in my email. Like I didn't print it out. Okay. I'm trying to save cool. the environment. I was expecting a small, small role. But when I saw the script, I saw my character's name was Dr. Maria Estevez. Here's the, the script. It's so long. Do you have to so, memorize it? Yeah. There's a few characters. There's Rambert, Maria. So I'm playing Maria. The last time I auditioned for something, I would say 11 years ago, 12 years ago. It is very weird to come in to an audition because here in Malaysia, I get the upper hand of not going to an audition. I get picked by producers and directors immediately for a role and I don't really have to get into an audition or read lines to get a role. I'll you should totally be Maria and then I'll be Archer and Rambert. And Rambert goes. Now, it is my pleasure to introduce Dr. Maria Estevez from the World Health Organization. That would be me. Dr. Estevez, over to you. Yeah. <laughs> Why are you waiting? <laughs> I don't know. Do people do that? Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. <laughs> oh my god, how do you see that? The severity. Severity. Uh, severity. Yo, yeah, that is serious. Okay, okay. Are, are You're you serious? A okay, oh my god, that is so hard. <laughs> how are you going to do that? It's like I a don't mouthful. Know. Go ahead. I thought... I'm just going to sip on my. Um... <laughs> and it's long. Although I've been working hard to get my green card and all this, and suddenly. Hollywood's just knocking right at my door so quickly, like right now. Go ahead. I'll do it in my Tom Select voice. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Dr. Estevez, <laughs> you make it sound like we're to blame, but we're not the criminals here. <sighs> of course. You know, it's Maria. <laughs> of course. You're not going to go, of course. Oh, okay. You're very serious. I'm very serious. But You're some... talking about the problems. They've been producing like fake antibiotics and all that that's affecting I don't know what like, that means, but I'm going to pretend like I know what that means. Of course. Okay. Well, your company invests billions. God, that's a lot of tongue twisted. I don't even know if I can do it. I'm probably going to embarrass myself. Like, I know. Being I'm all nervous insecure. for you. I still feel like I can. I cannot. I can't do it. Like, no, you know what? I like how you usually do when we were back in school is like to repeat it over and over in your head. Try to memorize as much as you can. I it's could really not even. It's really hard. V is always positive. She always looks at the bright side of things. I'm sick of the stomach. <laughs> I feel like a whole zoo in my stomach right now. I'm really nervous. We should just eat. The lobster has been staring at us. Oh, it looks so good. Oh my god, it's like me standing in front of the directors. Uh, it's like very you're stiff, gonna be very you're nervous. Gonna get yeah. Eat. I'm just gonna go with it. If I get the roll, I'm happy. If I don't, I'm happy too. Yes. I'm gonna devour that. You sure? Lobster. When the nomination for Best Actress came out and I was one of them, I quickly called Rizman and said, OK, so I'm nominated for Best Actress. God knows what's going to happen, but I want to be wearing a beautiful dress. Rizman! Ta-da! Rizman and Rizani are my, you know, two very closest friends that have been my friends for more than 10 years. Since we've been friends for 10 yeah. years, I have a confession. What? I actually have feelings for you. No. <laughs> Sida. Obviously, we do not have feelings for each other. I mean, seriously, we're like brother and sister. It's an incest thing. Yori, I don't have feelings for you. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you were older in this industry? Me? Mm. I think 13? 13, 13 years? 13. Yeah, 13 years. I mean, I feel really blessed to work with you because as a designer, kita macam ada macam muse, you know. And on it for me, bila you, kita membesar sama-sama and then you willing to wear our our creation because pas you pakai one baju and then confirm tomorrow there's a people gonna call me and ask about the baju.
I think it's almost predictable whenever I attend award shows, so I would be wearing Rizma Ruzani. Like, so many people would know, okay, you're wearing Rizma Ruzani. Okay, we know that. <laughs> and then, and then also, I want to talk to you about FFM. Uh -huh. I don't have a date, so yeah. you have to be my date. It's okay, no. we, we can work out. We, we should only, do crossfit this, we only this have Monday. few days. I will be your bodyguard. Uh, bodyguard why and date. Not? Okay. Yes, okay? <laughs> okay sure, Promise? Sure. Okay, sure, I'm sure. hungry. You know, when you talk about friendship, you don't really get many good friends around that would stay in your life and be there for you no matter what. And if you have people like Rizman, you would take care of them and you would be there for them as much as they would for you too. You should go eat. Okay, jump. Jump. Coming up. Don't ask me that. It was about a porn video of you. My lead actor, which is Trizy Sam, there was my ex-boyfriend. It was really awkward. Pelakon wanita terbaik FFM 27 dianugerahkan kepada... Tonight is the night I've been waiting for for so many years and to be able to be nominated again in Best Actress category at the Festival for Malaysia is such a dream come true and it's the night! Can we go Save time, so just buat je lah. We have to be there 7.30, so we have to go down from here 7. In my head, I'm planning and thinking, if I had won an Oscar today, what would I do? It would be something like, yay, thank you, God, thank you, my family, my friends, and then I'm going to fly home and bring my trophy and then possibly get married. <laughs> I don't want to wear the dress. Okay, Monday I'm getting back to fitness again. You want me to remind? Oh. <laughs> anyway, okay, I don't know what to feel. I didn't have the time to get my nails done and I know it looked really bad. So I decided to do my own nails because I'm just so good at it. I'm like a really cheap date. You know, I do my own makeup and I do my own nails for me. No <laughs> man has to pay for my shit. Mm -hmm, it's all free. Save me. In case nobody wants to marry me, I have to like take care of myself, you know, mm -hmm. keep all my money. FFM's the most prestigious award that you can ever get in Malaysia and I'm already going crazy. That's already big for me. Yeah. I, I'm happy that they bought KKL. I think part of Oscars. Being nominated for one category, I think, is probably a lucky thing for an actor. I won Plakon Harapan Terbaik 10 years ago. Kalau lah kata you menang for both categories, eh? You yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Whoa! I was just feeling nervous, but not so nervous. Excited. It was all these emotions, you know, in one. <laughs> this is how I should look like tonight. <laughs> you have style. <laughs> is it too much hair? Huh? I it's think it's too good already. You, okay, I think okay already. Already not, not nice. Too. When it comes to winning Best Actress, I've always dreamt and imagined in my head that I would be wearing a green peacock long sparkly dress. Yeah. <laughs> Can fit? Of course. Oh, I'm so fat right now. It was so magically beautiful. I thank Rizman for making it happen. Finally, when I arrived on the red carpet and when it was my turn to walk, the vibe was really crazy. Media and celebrity are like coffee and sugar. We need each other, we complement each other and uh, being there, surrounded by the media was very important to me. Tahun ni memang extra special sebab saya tak sangka dapat dua nomination. Kalau ada rezeki saya, Alhamdulillah. Kalau tak ada pun, saya sangat bersyukur kerana dapat dua nominations kan. Okay, apa-apa pun, uh, good luck. I can't wait for you to be on stage. Nak dengar speech you lagi sekali. <laughs> So as I finally made my way, what? I've been approached by a journalist and I've been asked with a rather inappropriate question. Don't ask me that. It was about a porn video of you and I said, well, I don't care about it. I mean, come on, don't I have better things to do in life? And I know that the journalist is just doing her job. Your bosses really need to have her head or his brain, like... 
position correctly that this is a festival for Malaysia, questions like that are off limits. Before presenting the award, I was backstage. I have met some celebrity friends. Hey, You're sure. presenting an award. He's the most promising. Most promising yeah, actor. Being won by Choi. Yeah. I will promise you, you will go back. Just to don't you. forget to mention my name. You're the reason why I'm so cheery. I'll be like, oh, my <laughs> I was standing in a green room, and then suddenly, there was my ex-boyfriend. My lead actor, which is Shaizi Sam, we were, you know, romantically involved in a relationship um, off camera, and so it helped me so much with my character's Ifti, and so it was really awkward. When I walked onto the stage to present the Best Promising Actress, it was such a surreal experience for me. Menang bagi pelakon harapan wanita Festival Filem Malaysia ke-27 ialah Don Chong untuk filem Chua. Even though I don't win Best Actress tonight, I was thinking, it's okay, at least I got on stage and presented an award to a new actress and that I have once won this award and knew exactly how it felt like. When they announced the category for Best Supporting Actress, uh, Anugerah kepada pelakon wanita pembantu terbaik dan calon-calonnya adalah My heart was beating like tu, 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 tu. Pembantu terbaik FFM 27 adalah Nadia Nisa terbaik dari langit And when I heard the winner for Best Supporting Actress wasn't me, it was not Nisa. I was really happy for her but at the same time I thought, okay, so this is it. Like, it's, the Best Actress is not going to be me because everyone else was winning and not me. So finally, when the category for Best Actress um, came on, Calon -calonnya adalah. And I thought, okay, well, you know, it could just be anyone and I'm going to be there and accept it and I'm going to be happy for everybody because I think everyone did a good job in their respective films. Pelakon wanita terbaik FFM 27 dianugerahkan kepada Fazura Manisna Cinta di Cambodia. When Kamadida said Fazura, I, oh my god, it was like a dream come true. It was like, wow, it finally happened. Pada ibu saya yang sentiasa mendoakan saya, kepada adik-beradik saya, sahabat-sahabat yang sentiasa menyokong saya, semua keluarga produksi manusia dari Kapadokia, this is for you. Then when I was on stage with Sam, I realised, hang on, we were in this movie together and we were in love in the movie and all that and I have to thank him as well for being one of the biggest contributors to all the emotions I had that, you know, led up to me winning this Best Actress Award. You get two nominations, Best Actress Award, how about that? <laughs> it was nice. Thank you, God. Yeah, it was really nice. This season, I'm facing up to Fazura. On your way to success, you're going to have to swallow something bitter along the way. We don't care what people say because we already know who we are. Ah, takut and nervous. Mm. <laughs> yeah, what do you think of my collection? Ah! What kind of a designer am I? What is happening next? You know, I really want to move forward to Hollywood. Maybe I'll become the French maid or something. I think this is so unfair. I think you're being really selfish right now. You're not done until I dominate the world. I have to lose at least five kilograms. Yeah. He's managed to lose everything. Okay. <laughs> there was an intruder. They couldn't trace him. Welcome to Manila. You've done more things Filipino than me, probably. <laughs> I'm not crying. I'm not crying. <laughs>